Salam, a popular word in Chad. It means peace in Arabic, and is not reserved only for the morning prayer call. You can hear it on the streets in the common greeting, Assalamu Alaikum, the peace of God be upon you. And of course, in the reply, Walikum Salam, and the peace of God be upon you. The morning is a time of movement. Mashi la madrasa, going to school, purchasing bread, or more specifically, khubs tishadi, chadian bread, simple but delicious bread, or transporting goods to the market. Asuk, the market, is centrally located in the capital. It is the economic heart of Nijamina, and a boggling volume of transactions take place there throughout the week. Asuk is an exciting place to be and it should make the destination list of every tourist visiting the area. Foot traffic slows down as the temperature on our street corner reaches 105 degrees. City workers lay down their shovels and step away from machinery to take a rest in the shade of a wall. Some few brave souls venture out into the stifling heat. Of course, there is plenty going on in the Jamina. The taxis keep driving their routes. And SUVs from the myriad non-governmental organizations keep popping up. Many agencies serving refugees from Darfur or the Central African Republic base their operations in the city. Someone in a nearby storefront turns on a stereo and showers the block of music. Foot traffic picks up as people return from work and eventually the floodgates open and the children are released from school. Play, mischief, and pure joy ensue. The children are truly a shining light in the Jamina. Only a couple hours after sundown, the streets are abandoned. But it is only a matter of time until the prayer calls and the activity and the excitement all start again on this one street corner in the immensity of Chadian life. <laughs>